Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Stephanie and we're gonna be talking all about self-care today in terms of just like extra treatments that you can do for your skin, face and body, especially during this colder time of the year. Um, if you've been watching my channel for a little while, you, you know I've been kind of like playing with the lighting in here and switching out, I don't know, like the layout of my channel. So this is like a slightly different background. It's kind of gonna give me a little bit more flexibility in terms of how close or not close I need to be. Oh my gosh. Wow, I, I think I'm including the blooper if that just happened, but there is a bug in my room. Oh, scared the heck out of me. Okay, we're back. So anyway, this is going to be all about like hydrating this winter, your face and your body. And this is in partnership with the website lookfantastic.com. Um, if you guys are not familiar, particularly for those of you who are in the United States, like me, um, if you've been watching beauty videos for a long time and you watch some of the UK beauty bloggers, you know that they have talked about Look Fantastic as a retailer for beauty products for years. And I was always so jealous because this website had so many products from like high end to drugstore. Um, and they had a lot of great promotions always going on, but we in the US could take part in it. So recently, Look Fantastic is now accessible to US buyers. So it's just another retailer that we can look to for sales and promotions on some of our favorite beauty brands. So I'm so excited to be partnering with them today because I do believe they are including a 22% off code for you to use if you are new to Look Fantastic. And it should be, should be able to work on all of the products that I'm talking about today that are on Look Fantastic. So with that being said, I have three different masks that I've been playing around with this winter to kind of help keep my skin in a really healthy glowing place. I do have more normal oily skin, so um, although it's very dehydrated, so if that's something that you struggle with as well in terms of like finding a happy balance for your normal oily skin, yet you know not overdoing it, then these are gonna be three masks you're gonna love. Um, but I also threw in some body care stuff that is not from Look Fantastic, but I think it just kind of goes with the theme of taking care of our skin this winter and just hydrating better. And this is a brand I have been eyeing for years and it's Sarah Chapman. So anything that is going to give me an overnight result of a facial, sign me up. Like that is what I'm all about. What really attracted me to this particular mask when I was looking at the website and shopping for myself was that it has CoQ10 in it. So CoQ10, if you're not, if you're not familiar, is really good for the rejuvenation and just kind of like infusing your cells internally and out and externally to be a more youth, to be in a more youthful place. So um, you probably have seen CoQ10 supplements. It's the same idea. It's just to kind of help rejuvenate and restore the cells to a more youthful appearance and um, like way of being like, what's the word? Function, a more youthful functionality. Anyway, um, so that is what really kind of attracted me to this. And I'm reading from the website because I want to get it perfectly right. Um, this is a facial that is supposed to tighten the skin, brighten the skin, hydrate and nourish and soothe the skin and kind of help with anti-aging. So I was like, okay, signs me up. Um, she also includes like a skincare facial in the ingredients. So let's just look at the bottle. Um, it's, whoops. It's in this kind of bottle with a pump. You need about one or two pumps. I've used this a couple times already. No irritation on my skin. Um, the, the instructions that it come with is really helpful because she does show you how to do her signature skinesis signature massage. So I don't know if my computer, my uh, thing's gonna focus, but you can kind of see there's like a chart of how to do the facial massage to really get like the full benefits of this overnight serum. So here, I'll give you a little idea of what it looks like. So it kind of goes on like an oil, right? It's pretty clear, kind of like a serum oil. That's what it feels like. It smells very much like rose and I think it's Yang Liang. Rose, jasmine, frangipani, I don't know if I'm saying that right, and tube rose. It's so much, it's very similar. If you guys have used Charlotte Tilbury, the Charlotte Tilbury, um, I think it's like her clay mask, goddess clay mask, they have similar um, notes of fragrance. It's the same, same idea. But I like that it's fragrance that's sourced from essential oils. It's nothing like gross and yucky and we don't know what it is. So what I liked about this is that you, all you have to do is put it on before bed, right? It's nothing that you have to wash off or anything like that. So 
Again, I took two pumps of this after I washed my face before bed. I put this on, the first night I used it, I didn't use a moisturizer. I wanted to just see what my skin would do. Um, but I realized it's, it's better performing when you actually finish it off with whatever moisturizer you normally use. And in the morning, my skin definitely felt a lot smoother. It felt more glowing. My makeup went on a lot nicer. And overall, I just felt like my skin just looked a lot more soothed which is the goal for me in the winter. I wanna have my, my normal oily dehydrated skin to feel quenched and soothed, and that way my makeup goes on prettier and my skin just overall feels more balanced. So I really like this. This is something that's really going to kind of show its effects more over time because it also has vitamin A in it, which if you don't know, retinol is a derivative of vitamin A. It has vitamin C to help brighten, vitamin E. Um, and then it's got some unique proprietary blends from Sarah Chapman's own line herself. So, um, but overall a very hydrating overnight facial. So I really enjoyed this one. So if you have not um, tried anything from Sarah Chapman yet, I highly recommend this and obviously take advantage of the Look Fantastic uh, promotion going on where um, I think you can get 22% off. So that's pretty cool. Okay, let's get into the next one. Um, this is one that I actually had years ago and I was so excited to repurchase because it's one of those things that I had a while back, I really loved, I ran out of it and I just didn't repurchase it because I'm always using new things. Um, this is the First Aid Beauty 5-in-1 Bouncy Mask. So if you've read my blog for a while, which I don't know if you have or not, uh, I used to love this. This is like just a great basic perfect mask if you have dehydrated skin. It's going to give you a very plumped, youthful, bouncy look. And that's like the best thing I can say about it. The, the name of the mask is perfect. It's um, called the bouncy mask. So this is what it looks like on the inside. It looks like a very gelish kind of texture. It smells like cucumber. It's so, um, it's like gelatinous. It's like a weird word, but that's kind of how it is. Um, I'll try to give you guys an idea, but it's very gelish, like a jelly, bouncy texture. So how you apply this guy, this is more like your traditional mask. So you would put a v nice, decently thick layer on your skin. Um, you can kind of see what it does to my hand there. It's just very like luminous and hydrating looking. Um, so you put it on before bed and you let it sit. I want to say it's 10 minutes. I usually leave it on pretty long. Yeah, 10 minutes. I like to leave this on longer than that. The longer the better, I feel like, with this. Um, and then when you rinse it off, your skin just feels really soothed. And that's gonna be like the, the name of the game with all of these products. But the difference between the Sarah Chapman one and the Bouncy Mask is this is more just like an everyday pick-me-up if you feel like your skin's looking a little lackluster, a little dull, a little flaky. Um, this is more like an intense treatment that you want to see like some anti-aging benefits from. This guy's more just like a calming, plumping, soothing treatment. Use it a couple times a week, 10 minutes before you go to bed. Um, and just your skincare is just going to absorb better because your skin is in a more hydrated state and it's just going to be a little happier. So, um, I love this guy. It's such an underrated little gem for your first skincare arsenal. Definitely check this out if you have dehydrated skin. Okay, and then the last one was something totally new to me. I was really kind of like browsing the Look Fantastic website because I wanted to try some brands that I don't normally see in the US. So um, that is how I stumbled upon this brand called, I think it's called Laboratories Florga. Florga. It seemed to be very popular on a lot of different websites. So Look Fantastic, I was able to get it for cheaper because of the sale and the promotions they have. But if you look this brand up on other websites and just read reviews, this is rave, like very rave reviews. So this is the Mezzo Mask. It's the Smoothing Radiance Mask. So what really attracted me, number one for this, is that this is suitable for pregnant women. Now, I am not currently pregnant, but I hope to be in the next year. So I'm conscious of what I'm using on my skin. Um, you guys know I am into cleaner beauty, so that made me feel better. It's also paraben-free and cruelty-free, so that's cool. This is one that you, again, apply like a traditional mask. You would put this on before bed. Um, leave it on your, well, not just before bed, but I like to use masks before bed because then I like to like let whatever magic they're going to do kind of be on my face all night. Um, so I cleanse my skin before bed. I would put on a nice, decently thick layer of this on. It says to leave it on 15 to 30 minutes. I like to leave it on for the full 30 minutes. Um, 
and then you wipe it off with a damp cotton, cotton or, or wool pad and then you just finish it off with your normal night routine of like your moisturizers. So what I really liked about this guy is that it's chock full of collagen. Um, it's also just an anti-wrinkle lightening face mask to enhance radiance. So what I really liked about this guy and what made me want to try it is that it's supposed to be really good at like reviving fatigue in the skin and as a mom of a toddler, I'm all about that. Like, please get rid of the fatigue in my skin. It also has ingredients that help relieve irritation. So I have skin that's also highly reactive. So I break out to a lot of things. This did not break me out. It made my skin feel really calmed and soothed. Again, soothed. Um, and it's also just a really good anti-aging mask. So it's meant to kind of give you a more younger looking, resilient complexion. It's supposed to help relieve the signs of tiredness and leave you with a plumper, smoother appearance that is fresh and radiant. So. Something I noticed when I used this, specifically I actually tried it again last night. Um, so I have a little bit of acne breakouts around my face that are kind of calming down right now. Um, so they're in that place of healing where there's a little bit of flakiness around some of them and you know that can kind of pick up on makeup a little bit. And I feel like my makeup looks pretty good today. Um, I wanna attribute that to this. So when I applied this last night, again, I left it on for the full 30 minutes and then I, I wiped it off with, a, with a, um, like a little washcloth and then I finished off my skincare. But what I will say today is I have, where's my little spot? I have a spot up here and I have some spots on my jawline that I always do, but they were like completely healed and like any little flaky bits that were around the acne seemed much more uh, smooth. The flakiness is gone. The, the spot itself even looked a little bit more like calmed down and reduced in size. So I do think that this this one, I, these two, the Sarah Chapman and the Falorga, if that's how you say it, seem to perform the most magical way overnight. The bouncy mask is one to just have in your arsenal for like that everyday pick me up, like I said. But these two specifically, I'm most impressed with in terms of immediate results and, and feeling a change in my skin. So totally love these, all three of these, but if you have not tried Look Fantastic yet, check out their website, especially if you're in the US, because again, you can get promotions that we're not finding on other retailers. There's everything from drugstore brands to high-end stuff, so such a great opportunity for us now in the United States to score some stuff that we might not have access to um, otherwise and potentially get it for cheaper. So um, thank you so much to Look Fantastic for partnering with me on this section of my video, but let's roll into some of the body care stuff so this is a very clean brand and i'm so happy to be talking about this if you follow me on instagram i've talked about this brand for a few months now and i'm so so happy with their products so um this is necessary so you might have seen these products on instagram if you're a beauty person um they are hyper hyper clean so when i say that i mean the ingredients are super simple but they're so good for your skin now this is a gel based body wash that feels like a gel oil when you apply it. My husband has extremely dry skin and he is obsessed with this. This, so I'm currently using my second bottle in the shower. This will be our third and I have another one on deck because I stocked up during the Black Friday sale that they had. Um, so they have a few different fragrances. They have fragrance free, but they also have sandalwood and bergamot. Um, and eucalyptus. I love sandalwood and bergamot best. Both of those smell, smells are really lovely. They're sourced from essential oil, so no synthetic fragrances. And the ingredients, like I said, I'll insert them here. They're just very simple. They have a lot of nourishing vitamins and minerals in these formulas to really do good for your skin while cleaning your skin. Um, so I love this body wash. I mean, I can't say anything good, more good about it. The body wash has been incredible. If you have super dry, sensitive skin and you just wanna be using a cleaner body wash, which is something I think is super important, like besides like skincare and makeup being clean, guys, like everybody uses body wash. Everybody's cleaning their bodies on a regular basis, I hope. Um, we really need to be using clean products for our bodies. So um, Necessaire really checks off the list, the bill for me. I'm, I'm really happy with this line. Necessaire is, is probably my number one body wash and body um, brand for every day. Now, they also have a, couple, have a couple other things that I wanna talk about. So um, we're gonna talk a little bit about body lotion and body serums and 
dry brushing, okay? So if you're not familiar with what dry brushing is, dry brushing is exactly what it sounds like. It's dry brushing your skin. Um, it's dry brushing your body skin. So what you're gonna do with dry brushing is prior to getting in the bath or shower, you're gonna take about five minutes. This doesn't have to take long. And you're gonna brush towards your heart. So I like to do each section of my body for about 30 seconds. I know sometimes people will say at least a minute or maybe more, but I don't really have time for that. So I like to do 30 seconds brushing my arm, 30 seconds this arm, 30 seconds each leg, and about 30 seconds on my stomach and my back. And again, upwards towards your heart. So this way, and then same thing with your legs, upwards towards your heart. It's gonna help with the blood flow. It's gonna help bring blood closer to the skin, which is going to help with lymphatic drainage. It's going to help just remove excess dry flakies on your skin because you're brushing them down. So then that way when, again, it's almost like skincare, when you're exfoliating your body, all your body lotions are gonna penetrate better and therefore work better in healing your skin. Um, also, lymphatic drainage can help reduce the appearance of cellulite, if not get rid of it. And I swear to you guys, I dry brushed religiously when I was pregnant and I never got a stretch mark. I didn't have like enhanced cellulite. It was really kind of amazing. And yes, I do work out and yes, I do eat healthy, but I think anything that's gonna help you reduce the appearance of cellulite or just enhance the, the look of your skin in terms of just healthy, glowing, luminous skin on your face and body, you know, five minutes before you take a shower is worth it. So. Again, dry brush before you get in your shower, and then after your shower, you're gonna moisturize. So something that's new to probably a lot of you is a body serum. I think we're gonna see a lot about body serums in 2021. It's been something that brands are trying to kind of get people on board with the last couple of years, but it's for a good reason. So we are so into putting serums on our faces and treatments like masks and things like that on our faces because that's what people see. But to be totally honest, guys, we're still aging everywhere else. So especially on our decollete area, um, our hands, even on our thighs and our knees as we get older, you can tell like the skin gets more crepey and just not as tight and firm as it used to be. So we really should be taking care of our entire body, but it's just one of those things that we kind of put to the side. So I challenge you this year to take better care of your skin by using a mask a couple days a week and trying some of these things with your body, whether you're gonna incorporate dry brushing or incorporate a serum, do it. So what's nice about the um, Necessaire Serum is this is a hyaluronic acid based serum. So it's meant to increase the body's ability to, um, hold, what's the word, hold on to moisture. So what's nice about this is it's again, a, a gel like texture, kind of like the bouncy serum. So what I do is I either put this on first on my body and then I top it off with the body lotion. Both of these are fragrance free by the way, or I mix them. I'll put like a pump of the serum with a little bit of the body lotion and just apply it on. And it just gives your skin such a plumpness. And because they're fragrance free, you don't have to worry about smelling weird or any irritation. And what I like the most about Necessaire's body products is how fast they absorb while actually hydrating the skin. I think that that's something that happens a lot with um, some lotions that absorb really quickly is they're just not hydrating enough. But I find that the Necessaire line does an amazing job at hydrating very, very well while being super lightweight and absorbing quickly. So um, I just wanted to share a couple of those tricks with you guys for uh, this dry time of the year. Some face masks I've been loving as well as some body care that I have talked about on my Instagram but didn't have a chance to share here on YouTube. Um, I do I do think I actually have a necessary um, discount code if you are interested. I know that sounds like super like gimmicky but honestly I've been using this stuff since September, maybe even before, um, and I've just been really happy with it. And you guys know I've been trying a lot of clean, clean brands lately, but um, this one has been my favorite for body stuff. So I hope that's helpful for you. You can find these dry brushes on Amazon. Um, this one happened to be from Beauty Counters Holiday Sets, but you can get them at Target, you can get them at the drug stores, you can get them at um, Whole Foods and, and things like that. They're all over the place now, so they're not hard to find. They're, you know, pretty affordable. You can find more expensive ones, but you can find a lot that are in the five to $10 range. So anyway, let me know what you're going to try. If you're going to pick up one of these masks, or if you're going to incorporate using a body serum or, or dry brush this year, I really hope you take part in something like that. I will be doing all of the above. So anyway, I hope that's helpful for you guys and I'll talk to you soon.